just another quick video showing how you can uh, take your video broadcasting, your video streaming from Virtual DJ and actually stream it to multiple platforms at once using a little middleman, a free one, I might add. So uh, first I set up whatever I want to broadcast. So I'm going to add a, add, add a shader here. So that's one of the shaders. That's fine. I'll just go with that one. And then I will add my camera on top. And that's using the new Chromacast. I don't really have a green screen. So this is what we got, my face. And all the black is gone and replaced by my shader. So that's fine for this little test. And down here, the, I then have my, uh, my little video skin. So if I play the track, it'll be like this. So that's fine for this video. So I'll move this a little bit so we can see something. So I have this running. And then, of course, usually if I wanted to broadcast it, I just go into broadcast. And then, for instance, if I wanted to broadcast on Twitch, I'll, uh, use, I'll set it up as Twitch broadcast and I'll start broadcasting like that. But then if I also want to, um, I could of course come uh, do that in combination with audio or uh, radio server or, or podcast broadcasting, but I really want to uh, let it happen on Facebook as well, for instance. But I can't do that because I can start that too. So that won't work. Okay. So what I want to do, well, I'm going to use some middleman. So I'll stop this broadcast and then I'm going to go into my browser. Yeah, and I'll say, well, I'm going to use a, a service called Restream. And I've already set up my account here, and I've already added three channels to it. So I've got my Twitch channel, I have my Twitch account here, my YouTube account here, and my Facebook account here. And uh, of course, I've given all the credentials needed to go in there. And this is the free, free version. You can upgrade it to, to get a lot more stuff, a thousand things. Um, but that's quite a lot already in the free version so you can see you've got a lot of different options for where to stream to but right now i got these three and i have turned up on twitch and i've turned on facebook one of the limitations is that it can only send to your personal page so if you've got a band page or a group page you can't send to that in a free version but this will just be my my personal one so that's why i want to stream so what do i do then well i need the the url because Virtual DJ will know about this page. So if we go back to Virtual DJ, say, well, I want to go to other and to this URL and then go back to stream again and copy the, the stream key, copy to clipboard, go back to Virtual DJ, put in the stream key like that. And I'm good to go. So I start my broadcast like that. And I play my track. So I get this. This is what I want to broadcast. And I'll go back to Restream. And you can see it already has it now. It's getting my stream. And it's restreaming it to whatever I enabled, which is right now Twitch and Facebook. So if it goes to my Twitch page, here. You see, that's actually already getting my stream. I've turned up the sound here, so if I turn that on, we'll get two uh, audio inputs because, of course, of course, there's a, de there's a delay, there's latency, so you won't don't want to listen to it at the same time. Then I go to my Facebook page here. You can see on my personal Facebook page. Sorry, I also have a stream running. I'll turn the alarm down for that one soon, like that. So now I'm actually streaming to both Twitch and Facebook at the same time using this middleman, but all the done directly from inside Visual DJ.